This stunning Star Wars cosplay shows General Hera Syndulla of Star Wars Rebels and Ahsoka, ready for action in her iconic Rebel Alliance pilot outfit. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, please subscribe and keep watching for more details. Cosplayer Elenia Frost flawlessly portrays Hera Syndulla in her live action version from the Ahsoka Disney Plus TV show capturing all the intricate details of the character's appearance. This cosplay showcases Hera in her traditional Rebel Alliance pilot outfit, deviating from her usual casual uniform seen in the Ahsoka series, giving fans a glimpse of her past and her role in the New Republic. Hera's tense exchange with Senator Ixiono in Ahsoka hints at the complexities of her post-war adjustment and the presence of lingering Empire sympathizers within the New Republic, providing potential plot points for Ahsoka Season 2 and Dave Filoni's upcoming Star Wars movie. One cosplayer is giving Star Wars a run for its money with her interpretation of the Ahsoka Disney Plus TV show's live-action version of Hera Syndulla. Previously animated in Star Wars Rebels, Live-action Hera is portrayed by Mary Elizabeth Winstead in the Ahsoka series, who dons the green skin and leku with grace. Taking a beloved character from animation to live-action is no small feat, though particularly when that character is Twi'lek, and there is always a bit of speculation about whether that transition will work. Despite the difficulty of bringing animation to life, this cosplayer has made that transformation look easy. Elenia Frost's Hera cosplay is absolutely flawless. The image, which is so beautiful it could pass as fan art, shows Hera in a traditional Rebel Alliance pilot outfit and has the details perfected down to Hera's Leku markings. Perhaps the best aspect of this cosplay is the way it alludes to Hera's role in Ahsoka helping the New Republic in the wake of the fall of the Empire. At the same time, this cosplay portrays Hera in a way she hasn't appeared since Rebels, as the General has yet to put her trusty flight suit back on. Throughout Ahsoka, Hera is rather seen wearing her casual uniform. Along with her jacket, she's no doubt had some help from Sabine Wren customizing. This cosplay is a wonderful interpretation of what live-action Hera would look like in her orange flight suit, and it's exemplary of what exactly Hera's role in the New Republic currently is. Although an image of Hera in Rebel Alliance gear is exciting, the relationship between Hera and at least one New Republic senator is strained, in part because her place in this new government, after the rebellion has ended, seems to be in question. In the seventh episode of Ahsoka, Part 7, Dreams and Madness, Hera shares a heated exchange with Senator Ixiano while in court for her unsanctioned actions. This seems to signal not only that Hera is struggling to adjust post-war, but also that the New Republic is already poised to be in denial about lingering Empire sympathizers. With Star Wars, The Force Awakens, the fate of the New Republic has already been sealed, but the steps to their downfall and the rise of the First Order are less defined. Perhaps this state of denial ultimately gives way to the vulnerabilities that the First Order exploits, or perhaps these fissures within the New Republic's own ranks are part of their undoing. Ahsoka Season 2 could explore these considerations in more detail, and it's going to be fascinating to see the politics play out throughout Ahsoka and Dave Filoni's upcoming Star Wars movie. 